Let's get Bobby Rubino fed. Come on, dude. You know you're in the mood, dude. There you go, dude. You have a tick on you, darling. Don't bite my finger, please. Come on, dude. Oh, oh God! Come on, Slinky. There you go. Oh, God. Oh, shit. My lizards are trying to kill me today. Stay there, buddy. Uh, sh <laughs> yes! What's going on, everybody? Kevin here, hanging out in Buttercup's home. There she is, the Princess Buttercup. She's about to get her feet on right now. You guys are gonna come along with me while I do a couple of chores. We're gonna feed some animals, uh, and then we are gonna catch some fish for Sophia's pond. I have no fish in there since we put the pond in. Kind of ridiculous. Hey, hey, buddy, buddy Buttercup. It's Buddy Cup. He's my Buddy Cup. Come here, come here, Buddy Cup. Come on, come on, oh, brother. There you go, there's a snakey, and I love her so much. Um, she's easy to feed, we just love her so, don't we? And uh, we just get another little ratty poo, and we're gonna put it right here under the light, there you go. And there's one more little colossal rat that we got from the uh, Loxahatchee Herb Hatchery. Ah, oh, there you go. All right, she'll find those, she'll eat them. It'll be great. We love her. She's doing awesome, as you can see. Buttercup is growing nicely. She's got a large enclosure, which is the way I love to keep these big snakes. I always consider this like some kind of mine shaft cave that she lives in, that the, the dreaded white snake, the legendary white snake lives in, I don't know. I like to make up little stories about the critters and how they came to be here. I don't know, I have an imagination. Sometimes I like to use it. What are you gonna do? So sue me. Anyway, we're gonna shut this thing right now. We got a whole lot of mouths to feed. We got chores to do. I wanna make sure we get some cichlids in Sophia's pond, so we're gonna try and catch those shortly. But uh, in the meantime, we've got some other animals that need feed. Okay, so we're moving along. I'm feeding the carnivores on account that my lovely assistant, Sophia, when she gets home from school today, she'll be taking care of the herbivores or the, uh, what do you call it? Grassosaurus, I don't know. Veggie source, that's right. Just like in Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park, speaking of a veggie source, there is an, uh, yeah, I seen your guapo. Hi, bud. There's no food for you today until later. All right, in the meantime, in the meantime, hey, look who it is. It's Cersei, she knocked down that thing. Did you knock that thing down there, Cersei Poops? Cersei Poopies. She ate a lot of her lettuce, too. Gave her little dibs of lettuce. We need this right here because we're gonna get our girl out, Inky. But first, but first, let's say hello to Cersei's. Oh, Cersei Poopies. Oh, I gotta put her on. Come here. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're so shy. She's doing okay. She's a shy one, which is normal for this type of tortoise. Let's go ahead. I'll just rake this up real quick. We'll get thrown up there and I'll put it in the bucket later. Okay. What were we doing? Hey, let's feed Bobby Rubino. See this food? Let's see. We got a couple of mice. Let's get Bobby Rubino fed. Rubino. Bobby Rubino. Bobby Rubino Cam. It's Rubino Cam. For the best mice in the video, you got to check out. Bobby Rubino, you know the mood? What's up? Come on, dude. You know you're in the mood, dude. There you go, dude. You see how he's kind of goofy, though? Good old Bobby. Bobby's been through a lot in his short little life, hasn't he? Bobby's got a kink tail. He's got neurological problems. He was ripped off, but he's back. He also froze almost halfway to death. God, we love you, Bobby. Bobby Rubino, we love you so much. You're the coolest dude, but I dare not touch because you really would bite me, I think. But anyway, come on, bud. Will you swallow that for everyone? They want to see how you're doing. You know, Bobby's one of those animals where it's basically, look, man, um, he's uh, under my uh, supervision and uh, he's not the healthiest creature, but I love him. And, uh, you know, I try and give him the best life he can have. All right, so that's what we're doing with the Rubino. The fact that this dude is even alive after all that he's been through in his short life is pretty incredible. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Do you love Bobby or what, man? Are you happy that he found his way back to us even though he was discarded by some criminals and, uh, you know, we found him frozen almost half to death in my neighbor's yard? Pretty lame, dude. Well, not lame that I found him, but lame that he was stolen from me. Uh, you know, sucks. But we got him back. I'm going to go ahead and throw another mouse up here for Rubino. Just keep him, keep him happy. 
that good there you go bob and we even have let's give him a chick as well so he's going to get two mice and a chickadee and this will for sure be enough for him for the week there he is you just go ahead and do your thing robert okay i love you dude all right we'll let him do his thing he's going to start swallowing we need to get the yankees out gosh she does not like her greens so we're going to take these out as well and we'll place them here throw this here and we'll pull it out uh well here we are the inks me thinks me thinks it's time to talk about inks this is a little bit of a food tray i gotta clean out her water we got a lot to do let's see how There she is. Just a thrilling, wonderful specimen. Hey, hold on a second. I need a latch. I need to put a latch on this. That would help, uh, but I don't have one. So I'm gonna get creative. <laughs> you guys must love this. You must love this. There you go, creativity. Okay, we're gonna start with a um, chick. Get her attention. Come on. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there you go. She's so shy, but she likes to eat her chicks. Um, she's getting bigger, she's happy. Well, I don't know if she's happy, she's always kind of angry, but I almost lost her too, as you guys know. Or maybe you don't know. I don't know what you watch and what you don't, but that's Inky. Inky was 100% stolen from me, and uh, she was retrieved by very good detectives here in uh, Palm Beach County. They had to drive all the way down to Florida City where the criminals lived and uh, they got her back. So I'm really excited, um, good stuff. So she's gonna try and orient, or how do I say it? Orient, orientate, or I, I never know how to say that word. She's gonna orientate <laughs> the head first and she's gonna swallow it. I think, I think that's what she's gonna do. And I'm gonna try and get her out here on the next feed. In the meantime, what's going on with the Rubino? Oh yeah, he's still working on, everyone's working slow today, man. He's still going with this little rodent, little mousy. Keep eating, buddy. Keep going. That's a boy. Everything Bobby does is a little bit slow, but um, you know what? I don't begrudge him that. I just go ahead and let him do his thing. And we love Bobby. Good boy. I love it. Thank you so much for eating. On command. Box turtle from China. Chinese box turtle. Flava Cora Marginata. No, no. <laughs> what am I talking about? I am totally having a brain fade. It's Cora Flava Marginata. Um, all right. Let's just do this here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Settle down, little lady. I know you have a murderous rage in your heart, but you and I need to become friends. Um, this is kind of neat. These plants are growing back. I love it. Look at that. They're going to grow nice and tall. It's going to be beautiful. Uh, all right. Well, she's still going. I want to get her a rodent, but I keep disturbing her. So what we'll do. Uh, let's see. Where's another little piece of rodente? Al dente rodente. No. It's got to be another one. I know I have them. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Does this look appetizing, friends? Let me know. It might be appetizing if you are a carnivorous reptile, but not for a human being. All right. I'll just place this here. She'll go ahead and get it. We'll come back. We'll shut the door. Keep going, kid. That's a pretty big meal, so I'm, I'm glad to be giving it to her. I like to uh, get her nice and big. We're trying to get her big and happy, and uh, I think it's working. She's getting kind of big. She's going to be moving on up to a new enclosure soon. Once I get all this caiman stuff dealt with, and we got my buddy Ruben coming over here in a little while, and Ruben is going to actually help us with the fence because he did the fence for the gators, who we'll see here shortly. Don't forget, we got to get those cichlids too. I hope I get lucky because it's not easy to catch the cichlids. Okay, moving along. Let's go ahead and see. Oh, look. 
Still no fence, but like I said, Ruben's gonna be coming over. We're gonna get this thing done. I'm excited. And uh, you know, I mean, there's a lot going on over here. Sometimes it gets a little bit overwhelming, but um, I'm getting my energy levels back up again. And we're gonna be uh, working hard to get those Caymans set up. Hopefully in the next week or two, we'll be able to get them out here and uh, moved, which should be pretty amazing. And it'll be an amazing accomplishment here for the camp. So I'm, I'm pretty pumped on that. But right now, let's see, there's inks. No, pinks. I really need to come up with names that aren't as confusing as I get older and uh, less. You know, my early onset dementia is happening. Come on. All right, this is it. Let's see, what are we gonna give her? How about a chickadee? Oh yeah, come on down. You're always a pinky to me. Good girl. It's my pinky. Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't you have a specific way you want to do it? I don't think that's the right way, is it? No? Maybe? Yeah? Okay, good. Yeah, come on. There you go. That's our baby. Ooh, yuck. That was not good. Oh, I guess it was good. Well, then you know what you get? You get another one. Mm -hmm. All right. Asian water monitor, it's a female. There's a lot of, there's a big difference in size between the males and females in some locales. And uh, right now you're seeing a smaller, a smaller example of a female, but she is in fact an adult. She does deserve a little bit more food. We gotta move some of this around here. Let's move it around, move it around. She'll get a little rodente. How about a mousey poo? You gonna move for a mouse? Of course you are. Of course you are. She's never met a meal she would turn down. Never, not once, not one time. Love you. Oh, she's got a little bit of a tick on her. This should be interesting. How do you get a tick off your water monitor's chinny chin chin? I don't want you to have a tick on you, darling. Do you trust me? Good girl. Easy does it. This is not food. This is not food. Yeah, this is gonna be good. We're gonna have to get this tick off, people. And uh, I hope I can get it off without losing a finger. I hope I can get it off without losing my finger. Don't bite me, love. Easy does it. Easy does it. Don't bite my finger, please. Don't bite my finger, please. Come over here. That's not, that's not tasty. That's not taste time. That's not, that's not taste time. I want to keep, come on, girl. Oh, sh she got me. Oh, God. Look at that. That's my fault. Look at that. And I pulled away. I pulled away. We still got to get the tick. Um, what are you going to do? Things happen. Things happen with lizards. Golly, you bit me and I'm trying to help you. Whoa, sheesh Louise. Hey, you know what I got to do? I think I'm going to have to restrain your little face. So I tried to do it the easy way, but it's not going to happen. Good grief. Um, hi. I got an idea. Where's my tongs? That hurt. Just FYI, don't do what I just did. That was dumb. You know what? Wait a second. Come here. Wait a second. Wait a second. This is this is what would this is what separates us from lower primates. I should have done this first. Oh, oh it's so close. I'm leaking. I'm leaking, man. I'm leaking. She leaked me. Come here. Luckily, that wasn't a bad bite. Did I get it off? Come here. Come here. I gotta, I gotta grab you. I gotta grab you, little one. All right. There you go. All that for that little tick. Ooh. Now I'm gonna have to make sure. Oh, by the way, lots of blood, lots of blood. Um, for those of you that have a weak constitution, um, I apologize. It is what it is. You're going to get bit if you have reptiles. And that was dumb of me, just FYI. Oh, that was dumb. But I pay the price and I, I pay the price and I live with my mistakes. There you go. <laughs> what an idiot. Oh, anyway. The pinky is the only one that always bites me. I always trust her and that was stupid. Let's go uh, talk to Slinky and make sure that Slinky 
Let's make sure Slinky doesn't smell blood on my hands. That would be terrible. Oh, we still have a lot of things to do here in this uh, video. And I am not... I am not going to give up. You just don't stop when your lizards bite you. Uh, Slinky, are you around? Slinky! I hear something. Slinky! Slinky! Where are you, dude? Slinky! Well, we got water going. Slinky! Now imagine if Slinky bit me. That's what you got to be thinking of. Uh, Slinky, much larger. Slinky! Where is he? I hope he's not in here again. Nope, doesn't seem like it. He might just be in his house. Nope, not there. Where are you? That's empty. That's empty. Okay, people, I'm back. And uh, Slinky has made his way out and he will be coming out here momentarily so that we can feed him and continue on with our day here. There's always something going on. There's always a problem. Come on, Slinky. Come on, dude. I love this guy. Although he has figured out how to get behind that at Universal Rock. So I've got to come up with a plan, Stan. Figure out how I'm going to keep him from doing that. Here he comes, the lumbering giant. We're going to go ahead and grab him. How about a chicken? Come on, boy. Oh, you may be wondering where Lobo is. Lobo is in his crate and uh, Lobo's killing out. Look at this. Here we go. Come on. Lobo gets frisky around this time of day and you got to put him into bed just like a little child. Gets a little rambunctious. Come on, Slinky. There you go. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, that didn't last long. Oh, did it? All right. Well, we got that. We're not taking any chances with the Slinkers. He's got big teeth. Good boy. That's a good boy. Oh, we love him. Come on. There's a boy. He's looking good, though, I would say. What do you guys think? Does he look good? I think so. And he's so well-behaved. Such a well-behaved reptile. I love Slinky. Good man, Slinks. Let's see. Is there anything left in here for you? I think I want to feed the rest of this to the gators. Yeah. I think that's it, boy. I thought maybe there'd be a tiny mouse or something. Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus. Everyone is just in a mood today. Here. Come here. There you go. That'll, that'll wake you up. That'll wake you up, won't it? My lizards are trying to kill me today. But let's hope this doesn't bode. It doesn't... Uh, what is the word I want to use? It doesn't mean it's going to get worse when I get in with the alligators. I mean, at least I didn't lose a finger. Them alligators could be worse. Let's go see. Let's see what's going to happen. Uh, did I mention that we have to catch some fish also? So much work to do. But it's a fun day. All right. We got Lobo locked up inside, so I know Lobo's safe. And uh, right now, we're going to go gator him. What I probably will do is set you guys up, and um, we'll go hands-free on this. Oh, look, by the way, look at her. Didn't even see her. Let's go hands-free. Now, you may be wondering, hey, is that okay that the water's so low? Yeah, it is, because it's going to rain here. It's going to be raining soon. Easy, girl. It's going to be raining soon. And uh, it'll fill it up. Come on, Dale. Come on, Dale. Come on, Dale. We do it with this. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. Good girl, Dale. That's a good girl. Snaggy. Ow, ow. Oh, by the way, look at this. Here's Snaggy. Come on, Snaggy. Dale, stay. Let's go over this way. Come on. Come on, Dale. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. Up, 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 up. That's a girl. There you go. All right. Let's not die, anyone. All right. Let's close this gate, too. There goes Snaggy coming in. All right. Yay. Everyone's happy. Everything's good. 
Yeah, where it's snaggy. See, you can still submerge, so that's nice. Still submerging. Snaggy! Oh, 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 oh. Where's Snaggy gonna come out? There he is. Come on, Snag. Come on, come on. Come on, Snaggy. Come on. And I like to use the tongs. Open, open, open. Up, 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 up. You missed it. You missed it. Stay there, buddy. Uh, it's getting out of hand. <laughs> Holy shit, he's coming. <sighs> oh my God. Snaggy. Come on, boy. Oh, they're hungry today. They're hungry today. Let's get it. He missed that last one. Okay, boy. Up, up, up. Oh, God. He's, he, that's a nice pop. There you go. There you go. Cypress nuts. There you go. There it is. Easy, boy. Easy, boy. Easy, boy. That's what we like. There you go. That's a big boy. All right. Told you it'd be an exciting day. Told you it'd be an exciting day today. Come on. There you go. Oh, yes, you got it. Good boy. Good boy, Snaggy Poo. Come on. There it is. Oh, yeah. You just wanted the food. You don't want to kill me. You just want the foods. <laughs> All right, come on. Dale got two. Come on. There you go. Easy. Easy. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, my very own dinosaur trying to get some food here. All right. This is it. This is for the last one. Come on. Here you go. There's a good boy. There's a happy monster. Yes, you are a happy monster, aren't you? All right, dude. That's it, man. Thanks for playing. Um... The last thing I want is for Dale. There's Dale. See, I've been keeping an eye on her. I don't want her to cut me off. So there he is, Snags. Looking pretty good, dude. Oh, wow. You really got moving. He's hungry. Hungry Snaggletooth. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. That's all we got for you. I'm gonna hell out of here. Let's get out of here. Um, we're not going out that way. We're gonna have to go out this way. I think you guys understand why. Um, amazing, amazing. Well, let's go get some fish <laughs> for the exciting conclusion of this video. We're gonna go get some fish and uh, I gotta change my shorts. Oh great, you know what? I can't get to the lock from here, see? We gotta go back, we gotta go back. Oh, snap. Let's go back. I like adventure. Now my backyard is a true and proper adventure. Let's go. We're going to go back out. Now, hopefully, Dale wound up getting out over here. Look at all these slide marks because Snaggy was right up here. See, I don't have much of a walkway over there. Oh, look, and she's right there. So let's get her over here. Come here. Come here, Dale. We're going to get her over here look at the size of this guy's mitts look at this Whoo, that's something dale come on dale come on dale come on girl dale da 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 dale come on girl come on dale there you go. Good girl. Come on. Oh, bro. I'm in this swampy mess now. So what we're going to do is get her over here. Come on, Dale. We're going to get her up here. <laughs> Come on. And then I am going to make a break for it back over here. Hesitation will get you killed. He's still over there. Dale's over there. I'm going on this sketchy walkabout. Let's not slip and die into the gator pond. No way. I can tell you someone who is not going to like this video. Katie Pooh. My wife is going to be so mad when she sees this. But anyway, let's get one more look at our beautiful gators. Beautiful gator, gator, gators. All right, there's Dale. 
Snag, what's up? Oh, there's the rake and machete I've been looking for. Thank you. All right. Look at these guys. Look at them. Oh, boy. Everybody's moving. Everybody's grooving now. The Love Shack, baby. Get me out of here now. All right. Let's go get some cichlids, shall we? Uh, let me close this up, and I'll meet you guys by the pond. Okay. Here's what's got to happen. I'm going to try and get a fishy, but first we're going to set you guys up. I need to get a couple of fish, hopefully get some males and females. And uh, what we're going to do is uh, put them in the front pond. Okay, that's what's going to happen. So, um, yeah, wish me luck. Let's get a fish. Let's get a couple. Let's go. Come on, guys. Ah, uh, they're low. They ain't stupid, these fishies. These are not dumb fish. I just need a few. Because a few will turn into many. I don't know if this is going to happen like I want it to. Yep, I don't think this is going to work. Certainly not going to get two chances at it. But what I might be able to do is use two nets. Let's see if that works. Let's see if we can use one to chase the other, to chase them into another. I don't think so. It's still not going to work. These fish, I ain't leaving. These fish ain't leaving this here pond. All right, well, that sucks. All right. I'm actually not good at catching fish, it turns out. What a bummer, because I need them. I mean, I've got plenty of fish in the front, in the, this pond. Yeah, there ain't no way. All right, well. Big guns. Not doing too good, guys. I got bit today. My alligators almost ate me. And I can't catch any cichlids. <sighs> nightmare. It's a nightmare of a day. But I did anticipate a little um, difficulties in this video. And there's only one shot left. That is, if my fish trap worked. If my fish trap worked, this video is saved because all of my responsibilities will have been met and it looks like we've got some fish in the fish trap uh-huh i'm psyched there we go come on let's go put these guys in a new place that's all i need that is all i need to start a whole new group of fishies in this pond here we go Get you right in there, little one. Oh, there's a dead lizard in there, too. But he seems to have been in there for a while. All right, guys. Go swimming. Go swimming. Your fish. Go free. There we go. All right. Ah, oh, there's a dead frog, too. I'll have to leave this thing open instead of closed. All right, well, that's it. We got fish in the pond. How about it? We got everyone fed. We got fish in the pond. What? a day did you guys like the video were you guys scared <laughs> i'm scared i'll be honest with you i don't want to die maimed in my backyard but uh you know what i actually love the adventure and to be honest the gators were just coming for that bucket 
And uh, luckily I have nice outs. It's a big enough enclosure that I can get away from them. And uh, it was awesome. Uh, the other, the, the real dumb thing I did was trust Pinky and wound up getting myself bit. It happens, it's not her fault, it's mine. She was kind of looking for food and I was teasing her, but we had to get that tick off of her. So I will bleed for my animals. Yes, I will bleed for my animals, because I love them. All right, uh, real quick update, Lobo's fine. He's just in his crate, he was getting a little wild, and uh, every couple hours he's gotta be put down for a nappy poo. But um, if you wanna see Lobo, here he is. And in the meantime, listen to the serenity that I have of Puppy TV. See you guys later. I leave you with a shot of Lobo, hopefully sleeping.